Uptown residents, this is Kirk Hansen. An unmarked aircraft has crashed in our district. The crash site is now a restricted area. My people will proceed to secure it. The rest of you, go home and stay there. That is, unless you want to catch a stray bullet. I'm imposing a state of emergency in Dogtown until further notice. More news to come as the situation develops. Auctions are bullshit. V! Hey, V! Billy's best stop wieners right over here. Where'd you leave Charlie? Uh, yeah, he stayed on the force. Keeps his distance. All for the best, I guess. What happened, Bill? NCPD sack you? Chum, I sacked them. Had enough. All that stress and the Dodger biz? Think I popped two ulcers from that alone. All right, Bill. Hold the deets. <laughs> okay. Anywho. Brought you here because, well... You changed my life, Chum. Wanted to thank you. No, it ain't much, but... Here. Grab some meds. Thanks. Glad I could help. No, thank you. No, it might seem silly, but I finally found my place. Feeling happy, unbothered. Hell, I think I might be flourishing. Honest. Feeling kind of jealous. <laughs> Keep on rolling with the scop dogs, bud. Scop dog stand. Really think that's a good idea? <laughs> Gotta stand for I can run a full-on restaurant, right? True, first step's the hardest, but you still gotta take it.
I know you well. Shit now! None of your bitch! I had a nightmare recently. 
Gamo qui a vini. I'm just here on Biz! You have Biz with the Voodoo Boys? Yeah. Well, used to. After what you just did, thinking they'll want a new supplier. Voodoos can't just go to a Ripper for their chrome? This cyberware isn't for installing. It's for tinkering. It's some kind of experiment. Research on implants? What was that all about? Don't know, don't care. I got enough problems. Milko Alexis, a voodoo boy. Know the name? Yeah. About all I know, though. Guy practically lives in the net. Seems like he's got everyone walking on eggshells. Big deal, I guess. Where can I find him? Don't ask me. Got enough problems as it is. Came here to make a few ads, right? Tell me what I want to know and you will. Now you're speaking my language. Right, so these implants. The voodoos break most of them down. Looking for code exploits, new hacks, and so on. Whatever they don't use, they install in old robots. Piles of scrap, most of them, but one came together real nice. Robots? What for? What for? Think for a sec. If this Milko guy's so important, probably needs round the clock protection. Running out of time to spare. Know any way of getting around those bots. Nothing gets past their motion sensors. Slipping by unnoticed is a non-starter for sure. How's your aim? I manage. Hmm. The voodoos, they keep their bots in some kind of server room. I can overload the disk arrays, then you... You fuck up the servers till they go boom. Should result in a pulse big enough to melt the circs of the rank and file. Okay, feel free to Delta. I got work to do. Mmm, must be nice.
espérer ce notre pour ça y est.
Pourquoi ils ont fait ça pour moi comme ça systems 40%.
progress. Human life signature detected. Initiating a Evacuation protocol. Unlocking emergency exit. I'm linked to the runner, see? Don't want him to catch a ricochet, huh? Milko's a corpse already, but you've still got a choice. Whoever you are, I advise you step back. You would only waste your bullets on him. Trust me. I'm Agent Alan Noel, Netwatch. Organized crime specialist. I'm sure we can work something out. First I've seen a Netwatch agent ditch the tie and button up to get his hands dirty. Live with the enemy. We tried recruitment. More than once. None ever agreed, no matter our terms. We underestimated their loyalty to each other. Well, Alan, no watch agent or not, if you stand in my way, I'll be forced to remove you from it. At least let me unplug from Milko. Fine, but so much as a twitch, and you're a flatline. That's better. Now, listen to me. You can't kill Milko. Not yet. Want to stop me? Try. Months I've suffered this place. Hold up with these scabs on society. 
I aim to expose their web of blackmailers and murderers, like Milko. But to do that, I have to find out who's pulling the strings first. This Milko guy work for you? Your source? I piggyback whenever he jacks into the net. Try to pin down who's feeding him all this. Give me a chance. Do you realize how many more people you can save this way? I have reports of victims all along the coast. Milko is only one of the runners working for the Voodoo Boys. As soon as I find the head behind the operation, I can chop it off and end this for good. I need Milko. His death alone won't change anything. Understand? Guess you'll have to manage without Milko. Do not do this. <laughs> Hang on a sec, Hans. Remember our deal? Yes, the Black Sapphire. I have an entry strategy for you. Foolproof. Meet me at the Heavy Hearts. Okay, be there soon.
Helicopter, go!
Come on. Hey, you there. This is a nice place. So play nice, hear me? Got our eyes everywhere. Yeah? Can I help you? Let's get to know each other.
Já me não especificar o em conjunto. Acredito que vai passar. Ah, Messier, você não quer dizer. Você não quer dizer que você vai ter que ir para a casa. É bem, meu chefe. Eu não quero. Quitte l'or, je ne bagaille sous cette interne. Isn't V. V, my favorite Merc. Splendid. What you completed for me significantly shifted the playing field vis a vis Hansen. Excellent work, precisely as requested. Come on, Hans. Flattery? Really? Seems a little beneath you. An overused tactic. Agreed. Unnecessary. No, V, this is strictly business. For those who do their work well, praise is a mere restating of the facts. Maybe the one thing I didn't expect, to see the man behind the hollow curtain. The elusive Mr. Hands in the flesh. Not only did you rescue those clowns in blue, you also managed to eliminate Dodger. Calm, collected, and professional. Bravo. You have proven to be a person I can trust. Hence, my decision to drop the veil and meet in person. A rare occurrence, I assure you. Were I to have more virtuosos like you, I wager I'd have more than Dogtown in my grasp. Dogtown, Pacifica, then I'd line up the rest, snort, and it'd be done. Working with bona fide professionals, positively a treat. Gigs you had me do. How will they solve your Hanson sitch? Take a boxer. He can't knock out his opponent. What then? He goes to work on the body. Once his adversary's stamina wanes, he looks for his opening, connects fists with jaw. I know it may not seem all that clear from where you stand, but the gigs you have completed will allow me to audaciously shift some of the pawns and figures on the chessboard that is Dogtown. Checkmate is but a few moves away. So 
Sounds like you're out to get your hands dirty in local politics. Pun intended. Yes, well, Dogtown is a political arena like any other. It has its relations, arrangements, power struggles. A careless businessman might easily drown in the mud. Me, I prefer to stay dry. And arrest you in some tea. It's my own blend. Sure, why not? So, how did this combat zone become Dogtown? Do you know? I heard this and that. Something to do with the war? 2069. Colonel Hansen led an operation colorfully called Midnight Storm. The objective? To occupy this combat zone and establish an NUSA staging ground in Night City. Soon after, the sides agreed to a ceasefire. Hansen's force was left to fend for itself. Headquarters, the public, everyone feigned ignorance, pretending Hansen and company were never here. But our good colonel decided to put down roots. He declared this combat zone an NUSA territory. In our terms, he carved out an enclave for himself and went from soldier to arms dealer overnight. Marooned he was. Two weeks for a bullet to reach his brain, everyone thought. But his brain remained intact and he became a force to be reckoned with. A man whose existence is a threat to many is a dangerous man indeed. It's all well and good chit-chatting, but what about our deal? Did my part, time you did yours. Ah, indeed, yes. The Black Sapphire, Hanson's stronghold, guarded by elite soldiers. Military quarters are situated on lower levels, while top floors are a decadent haven for the ultra-rich. The building's blueprint was not easily procured, I should say. Hansen guards his hotel secrets as if they were an embarrassing rectal itch. But given a will, ways are usually found. You help a client of mine, they reciprocate, and I gain latitude. Quid pro quo in full effect. The building plans are yours. I'll even throw in vulnerabilities to watch for, a token of my appreciation. And, though this goes without saying, the data, its source, are completely secure. No one knows you have it. Data leaks, or lack thereof, are the difference between myself and, say, the late Mr. Deshawn. The Shard, Black Sapphire Info and Blueprints, all nooks and crannies. I trust it's all you need to waltz in and perform your planned pirouettes. Yet a word of caution. Even fully prepared, you'll be marching into a pit full of vipers. Watch your step. Thanks, Hans. I only hope this won't mark the end of our collaboration. Truth be told, a few new assignments seem imminent. Let me guess. More local political gaming? Activity is abundant in Dogtown, and behind closed doors, plots and schemes. Should change ever occur, as it inevitably must, someone really ought to pave the way for a smooth transition. Be looking forward to those new gigs, then. You will hear from me soon. This, I guarantee you. And V, whatever happens at the Black Sapphire, make sure you come back alive, hmm? You're going where local and international politics mix. Strong currents, both. I'll make sure to plant my feet firmly, then. Later, Hans.
Reed, got the data shard from hands. Our golden ticket into the Black Sapphire. Perfect. Send it to him. No worries. This connection's secure. Catch. It's on its way. And reception complete. I'll pass it on to Alex. And as soon as you're ready, join us at the Moth. If I'm not there when you arrive, just wait. Till then.
is a job, V. A journalist. Bree Whitney has fled into Dogtown. I need you to look after her. She fled? Means I gotta keep her tucked away? No. Bree has a lead. You're to help her complete her investigation. There's a corp on her tip. Well, as she put it, that is all she said. Miss Whitney seems to have some minor... Right, so, where am I meeting this mystery insistent woman? You'll go to her apartment first, on Skyline West. You're to collect an electronic access card. And no, do not say, this card, what's it open? I simply don't know. Contact me once this is sorted. You'll learn more details then.